What's going on, guys? It's Trinity Tribe. Back to a quick general read. This message is for the sign of Sagittarius. All right, so um, you guys' channel song was top notch. Um, I believe that's City Girls. Um, so some of you guys are just like in this energy, like you feeling yourself at the end of the day. You only could see yourself. I just heard, I don't see nobody but me who I'm going to lose to. So um, some of you guys just like dead in situations. You're focused on yourself. Um, the line that stood out was uh, shy boys say hi to me, broke boys say bye to me. So some of you guys are just in this energy of not accepting anything in which um, that's not deserving of your time, your energy or whatever the case may be. Some of you guys felt like um, you settled in the past. I seen a lot of happiness, bliss, drinking, celebrations. Some of you guys are on your way into the public light. I don't know what you're doing, but um, stardom is definitely on the horizons for Sagittarius out there. Um, also, I heard pressure. So it seemed like some of you guys' exes is trying to spin the block at this time. Um, some of you guys could have been upgraded. Um, if it's not your physical appearance, it's just your attitude and it's bringing these energies back in. Um, but, uh, like she said, um, you know, before I was this fly, like, you know, you ain't really have nothing to say to me, whatever the case may be. Um, somebody feel like you got that wet, wet, somebody want to come in and, um, they want to apply that pressure. <clears throat> somebody telling somebody they got to lick it. But um, look at like a candy cane. All right. Um, somebody out there like rough sex, deep, rough sex. All right. Um, South America be, could be significant or island boy or island girl. You could be there or you're dealing with somebody. Um, but you're definitely moving into stardom. Um, you guys are going to have a lot of money to to give out. I've seen the six of pentacles and a star. So something's about to come in whereas though you're able to balance out a situation. Some of you guys may be starting nonprofit organizations or for profit. You guys um have a very loving and giving heart and some of you guys are touched at this time with certain situations and you feel like you can contribute to these situations. All right, you're claiming your independence at this time. Miami could be significant. Um but you're definitely like on your way. I just heard independent contract. So Sagittarius 2022 is going to be a, a very good year for you moving forward. Some of you guys have cleared up a lot of karmic debt and it's nothing but happiness coming into your life because spirit feels like you deserve it at this time. Yeah, we have the two of fire. I just heard um, feeling like you're on top of the world by looking at this card. All right. Like, look, I don't see nobody but me who I'm going to lose to. This giraffe not looking down. <laughs> it's giraffe looking forward, focused. All right. Um, a lantern could be significant to somebody out there. But some of you guys feel like, you know, spirit is carrying you at this time. You could be by yourself. You really don't have anybody to support you at this time. I heard it's been like that for a very long time. And spirit is knowing that you're deserving of happiness at this time. And this is exactly what you're about to get. All right. So let's see what the two of fire is. Mm -mm. All right. So we have creative planning for the future, mapping prog progress, trusting in the unknown, spirit inspire ambition. I told you spirit is just leading the way for you. A lot of you guys are working on creative endeavors at this time. Things that's going to take you off right into the public's eye. There are going to be a lot of people touched by your work or what you're doing. A lot of people could definitely resonate with your energy at this time. And with that independent contract, I don't know if somebody's investing in you or something's going to be gifted to you, whereas though you're going to be able to take off. We have hangman. So you're thinking, you're thinking of, about what you're planning. Some of you guys have spent a long time in the hangman. And, you know, with this earth energy at the bottom, you guys are getting grounded and trying to build a, a solid foundation and, Spirit is assisting you. They're about to send some people uh, towards you at this time. Because like I said, um, you're deserving of it. But like I said, there's a lot of celebration coming in. The color orange and yellow could be significant, blue or green. But Spirit is saying you thought long enough. It's time to start putting things in motion at this time. All right, what do we have for the sign of Sagittarius? 
what do we have here for the sign of Sagittarius? Holy Spirit, can you message your spirits to keep on applying that pressure? I heard you putting your foot on who's next. Um, you ain't beefing with nobody. You done did it, everything. You don't got time to beef at this time anyway. So let these people, whoever, I don't know, let them beef with themselves. We have, are you searching for more love in your life? So love is going to be coming in too. Look within yourself. Embrace the love that re resides within you. Allow it to radiate all around you. Become a magnet for love, light, and well-being. And these gifts will come in. So some of you guys could be cleansing out that toxic energy. Um, Just trying to stay on the positive. I just heard uh, like um, some of you guys could be authors or planning on writing a book. I heard storytellers or somebody could be telling a story on you. Like somebody could have told a story on you, something that was false. And um, I just heard break every chain, uh, Tasha Cobb. So spirit's definitely about to come through. All right. Uh, the stone cuz cuz kunzite. Somebody may need to pick that up if you're searching for more love trying to find love within yourself at this time it's like i said somebody could be by themselves at this time spent a lot of time um you know i just heard introspection but thinking of thing thinking of what you want all right and um your thoughts are very positive at this time so keep them positive don't share your manifestations with certain people because they could be speaking down on what you're speaking of they, they put that negative energy in the air all right we have, are your emotions in turmoil? Or are you feeling uneasy? So this came out for Libra. So some of you guys could be dealing with the Libra. But Spirit is wanting you to um, go spend time by the water. This was the same message that they have. The aqua, aqua marine stone could be significant um, to you. Green or purple could be significant. Um, but you guys may want to get these stones. Whatever you're thinking about, Spirit wants you to go to the water and meditate about it. Yeah, do you like to garden? Are you a nature lover? Out out in nature, spend more time connecting with Mother Earth. Put your hands in the soil, your bare feet in the grass. Investigate the use of nature's pharmacies such as herbs and aromatherapy for general health and well-being. So some of you guys are healers. Some of you guys could possibly be coming up with herbs or whatever the case may be. Um, things that can heal or this is going to be in the near future. Some of you guys are thinking about this. All right, investing in some herbs or whatever. Um and I just heard I am a conqueror. So some of you guys could be trying to heal here from a sickness or you're wanting to help heal somebody. All right. So we have the temperance at the bottom of the deck here. Balanced energy. Beautiful, pure. You've um, balanced your lighter and your darker side. You're getting in tune with your emotions at this time. Separate from individuals who um, we have the page of cups, but separate from individuals who may be. In a negative energy, they may be projecting the energy. But with the Page of Cups here, the Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck, somebody is like really thinking of, you know, they're upset here. Somebody wants to offer you an apology. I just heard somebody's ashamed of themselves. And we have the Judgment card. So you could have called Judgment on a situation. This could be a water sign. But somebody, you know, may want to come back here with the Page of Cups. This person's still immature. And it's a fish in a cup. So, you know. It, it might not even be genuine here. So a water sign could be coming towards you to offer you love, but it may not be genuine. Bottom of the deck here, we have false person. So somebody's ashamed here that they, you know, could have painted you out for a negative light because I heard storytellers and we have privileged lady. So somebody put something negative out in the air about you. And, you know, this person's ashamed of what they've done at this time. I sense that this person did not come through with an apology, but with the page of cups, somebody's thinking about a five of cups. Somebody's in a lot of grief here. Yeah, because they came against the Empress. But at this time here, uh, Empress, your birth in, like I said, a lot of new ideas. And this could possibly be why this water sign or this air sign is watching you. Um, somebody's actually becoming sick with what you're watching or somebody's becoming sick of how you transform. All right, this person could have... Um, mental uh instability i just heard this person may need meds this person could have multiple personalities this person's fake all right but they want to come through at this time and give you an apology or whatever the case may be we have temperance and we have the hierophant all right so this could possibly be a taurus or uh yeah taurus or libra um who wants to come through possibly offer you marriage or some sort of commitment here a contract but somebody's ashamed of what they've done all right um 
Because in Taurus channel uh, reading, and I didn't get a chance to put it out yet, there was a Taurus doing spell work on somebody's car, and your car broke down. Um, and this person's upset, but I'm going to save that for Taurus, but it's funny how this hybrid font card came out. Um, cause this person here could have been obsessive and dominating and maybe this person didn't want you to have wills. Um, cause they could have possibly been in love with you and they wanted to confine you to a spot. All right. But, um, I'm going to save that for Taurus cause I got some words for Taurus for what came out for the reading. That wasn't cool. But you definitely came up in Taurus's reading, and it was definitely spell work being done on a, on a vehicle. And Spirit says that that person needs to replace that vehicle for somebody out there. That person's going to have a lot of karma moving forward here. All right. What's this Hierophant? Four of Cups, Six of Pentacles. So, you know, I don't know, um, guys, if this person rejected you in the past, overlooked you, or with the Four of Cups, this person didn't apologize here for taking stability away from you at this time this person wants to come through and balance out a situation but it seems like it's too late here it doesn't seem genuine for somebody this could be a water sign all right this taurus here could be balanced but like i said this person was too controlling this water sign here is ashamed of how they rejected you or they didn't offer you an apology they're they're upset about what they put out into the universe and what they're getting back how they didn't get a payout for whatever or whatever they did, it was whatever they got or did, it was it was short lived. All right, they they didn't reap any benefits from what occurred. Yeah, we have the Eight of Pentacles here. So yeah, some of you guys are working on your balance, your your, your balance and your stability. A lot of hard work, head in the books, focused on what you got to do here. There could be a Gemini here who's who's guarded, possibly could be feeling left out by your opportunities, or you could be feeling left out by this Gemini. All right, but somebody here is working really hard. Yeah, somebody's guarded here by your work and what you do. The Five of Pentacles, they could feel like you're you're leaving them out or this person wants a chance to sleep with you. Or they could be guarded by your work. They're watching you. Page of Swords, Six of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Five of Cups. This person is regretting not giving you a commitment. All right, that's why she's, she definitely said, um, you know, like in pressure, she was like, you know, you ain't want to talk to me when I wasn't this fly. So for somebody out there, I don't know if this is a Taurus, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Gemini here who could be looking at you, even a Libra who's in regret, possibly about your opportunities and how you're moving forward. And they're watching you. And some of them want to come through. An air sign seem fake. It could be an Aquarius here or Cancer or Scorpio who wants to come through with an apology, but it's fake. All right, they're only doing this because you're becoming victorious and stable. This Taurus is actually in regret for what they've done. All right, this Taurus is genuine. They know they shouldn't have done it, but this person is very controlling, whoever this is resonating for. All right, but a lot of people are sad at this time because of your um, your, your new opportunities. Specifically, it could be a, a church, a church member or the church or a religion who you, whatever did you separate from a religion? Yeah, the world card, something closed completely here. You're also closing cycles with family, recognizing how toxic they are and how they were working against you here, holding you back from your opportunities. Could have possibly been doing spell work on your opportunities so you couldn't surpass them. Yeah, seven of pentacles, nine of swords, and a four of wands. You know, they work really hard here to keep you in your head about your stability and you still move forward. All right. With the Seven of Pentacles in the world, they're just like, they can't believe what they've invested in with the Five of Cups right there because everything that they did to block you, you're still stable, you're still moving forward, all right? So somebody's definitely in their head crying about your stability. It could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or this person is stressed out here about their stability or this person wants to move with you or whoever they invested in, they're not happy with this person sleepless nights possibly a lot of cr crying and crying and praying nine of wands night of wands player energy here but definitely very anxious about taking action towards you at this time this person sees your building this could be a, a aries leo sagittarius fire sign of your, like like yourself but in the past here this this fire sign or this air sign didn't want to commit and, you know, they're wanting to bring you justice at this time, but somebody could still be in that energy of wanting to play. So 
this person is stressed out about giving out giving up their lifestyle at this time here with the um the hermit it could be a virgo watching you as well but somebody's doing some soul searching at this time trying to reach their higher selves you could possibly be inspiring this person at this time this person could be blocked or you know archangel michael could be protecting you from this person i heard this person could be toxic but they're watching you all right this person may may need meds or maybe you're creating uh the herbs for this person here all right yeah we got the seven of wands so you're guarded towards this person or like I said, the angels are blocking you from this person. We have the six of swords. So 76, 76 could be significant or 1976. Wasn't that when was that something about independence? Let me see. What special events occurred in 1976? Something about 1976. Oh, July 4th, United States. Oh, a disease outbreak. So somebody could have a disease. There could be some sort of outbreak going on in the, in the world or something like that. But 1976 is significant. No, that was 1776 when, when independence was claimed. But yeah. All right, but yeah, you guys are moving towards emotional fulfillment here. This Gemini, Libra, Aquarius feels like you bring them emotional stability, but they, they, you walked away or they walked away because of some sort of deception or somebody has options. So somebody called judgment on a situation. Children could be significant to this, to this um, situation and why this occurred. And that's the truth. My phone just lit up. So, all right, the divine is handing you something like right on a platter here. You could be a truth teller or speaker. We got, um, all right, so we got the Queen of Swords, the Lovers, the Eight of Swords, the King of Wands, and the Justice. All right, so this King of Wands is all up in their head about this connection with you. Some truth that you spoke to this person has this person in their head at this time. This person wants to take action to bring you justice. The Knight of Cups, the um, Three of Cups here, somebody may want to form some sort of partnership or alliance here. Somebody sees that you're about to celebrate or you're a very stable individual here. We got the Three of Wands, so you're going to be expanding. But you communicated something to you, to these lovers. I don't know if this is family or friends. Yeah, seven of swords. Something about something sneaky. Then I seen the nine of pentacles. And I just heard claiming your independence again. So some of you guys are just walking alone at this time. Recognizing that you'd rather be by yourself than in the company of people who are sneaking, lying, and cheating. All right. But whatever you communicated here to this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or this Aries, Leo... All right, somebody's in their head about it. They're thinking about it here, thinking about a connection with you. This person's very passionate about you here, and they're in their head about whatever, what, what has occurred. All right, what's the seven of swords? Definitely something that you're speaking with the page of wands, the tower, queen of cups. Maybe somebody's surprised of how you're speaking. All right, or I just heard, yeah, that bitch mad that I took a spot. Something. Who that, Nicki Minaj? You took somebody's spot, Sagittarius? Yeah, we have the star. Oh, shit. So somebody sneak, somebody's sneaking and watching you at this time here. They're sneaking, watching your opportunities. All right, yeah, five of wands. And somebody's all in their head about this here. Conflict. It could be an Aquarius. It could be an Aries. But this argument, somebody was greedy. That's just what it is. Somebody was greedy here. Somebody's recognizing it about themselves at this time, how greedy they were. Yeah, five of pentacles. All right. So somebody got left out. All right. Or somebody's feeling unstable without you here. Out in the cold, outcasted is what I just heard. We got the king of swords. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius here. Who could be mentally conflicted here. Possibly about your position. Stardom, fame here. 
or you guys were meant to be together, but this person wanted the options instead. Yeah, Four of Pentacles, they held back. Knight of Pentacles, but this person's going to be coming back around here with something solid when they're, when, when they're ready. Yeah, because they're obsessively thinking about this with the Devil card. All right, they're obsessed with their wet, wet. All right, we got the um, the devil and the, um, I just heard drip, drip. Yeah, somebody's obsessed here. They, they And I just heard sexual healing. So your, your sex is very healing. Um, you could have thought this person was toxic here. This person could be involved in a lot of third party Sagittarius. All right, so you could have called judgment. This person could be a Capricorn Aquarius here, Gemini Libra Aquarius. Yeah, the high priestess, because you're using your intuition at this time. This person is burdened that you use your intuition here because they possibly want you to be a part of a polygamous relationship or something like that. Yeah, something definitely ended, though, with the death card. What do we have here for Sagittarius? Yeah, we have adversity. I accept the challenge is the best way to learn. All right, so you guys definitely learn from your, your challenges, and that's why you're about to be upgraded. Spirit wants you to stop doubting yourself, or people doubted you through these challenges here. Uh, just heard, look, nigga, we made it. Somebody, somebody didn't think you would make it, but you're very grateful for these challenges that occurred because it helped you move forward. Some of you guys have recently healed from some health conditions here. So you, you should be thanking the most high for that now. Spirit is saying, don't worry about anything. I'm learning that worry doesn't change an outcome. So stress could have been contributing to your health issues here. Yeah, I've just seen trust, trust your intuition in the process. And we had blame. So somebody's blaming you as well. Like I said, the five of wands. A lot of arguments around you. Somebody's blaming you for your for their instability at this time. Yeah, we have trust and guilt, and it's because they went against you. All right. Um, imagination. I guess they imagined that you'd never walk away, or you wouldn't find out the shit that they were doing. Possibly in this unrequited love situation. All right. Spirit is saying, get your playful heart back. What's coming towards Sagittarius and love? Holy Spirit. What's coming towards Sagittarius and love? We have passion. So you're very passionate about what you're doing. Somebody's going to be coming in who's very passionate about you as well. There's going to be a lot of kissing involved in this situation. This is going to be real love. Yeah, we have calling in your soulmate and we have new love. Somebody may be needing to make the effort at this time. Somebody may be calling you in, but this person's not good at communicating. So it's not manifesting because spirit wants this person to be able to communicate because they know that's what you need at this time so if this person needs a friend or you need a friend just keep it on a friend basis and maybe just you're teaching this person how to communicate we have finances and career you and this person may be working together we have financial issues are factoring your love life or somebody's not communicating about finances or somebody's blaming you or worried about your finances we have make the effort and we have release your ex Somebody could be worried that you're still entangled with an ex here, but spirit is saying that this could be the one. All right. Let's see who Sagittarius could be dealing with or who's coming towards Sagittarius, Holy Spirit. So we have Pisces, we have Capricorn. Virgo and Gemini. All right. Taurus at the top and Aries at the back. So Sagittarius, um, that's all I have. Uh, let's see what this person would like to say to you. Anything that this person would like to say to Sagittarius at this time? Quick few messages. Curly hair, you can have that 